Hi, Larry, WD0 AKX. There's a geomagnetic storm in progress right now, and there's a lot of aurora activity on 6 meters. If you've never heard a 6 meter signal, a CW, on aurora propagation before, I'll let you take a listen here. It sounds real raspy, the CW notes, due to the uh, off the back scatter. Uh, there ends up being a lot of distortion on the signal. So let's take a look. Looking at solarham.net, it shows a solar a geomagnetic storm in progress, K index of 7, and it is showing the ionized part of the atmosphere here. This is where we would aim the uh, antennas north. Works best uh, to use a Yagi type antenna pointed north if you're in the northern hemisphere. All I have is a dipole, or it's actually a sloper dipole off the tower. We'll do some tuning around on 6, and hopefully we hear some signals. Also, after I finished this video, I did go outside and saw a wonderful display of northern lights. Best I've seen in years, actually, from this location. Radio signals are reflected off this ionized portion of the atmosphere. Almost sounds like spark gap transmissions. I'll let you listen in here. You are hearing CW or Morse code. Copy an N0KK, I believe. Looking him up on QRZ.com, here's a photo of his antennas. Looks like the 6 meter antenna. Beam is the second one from the top there. He probably has it pointed north right now. A9 station. So there's a little sample of some auroral propagation backscatter by six meters at my location here in southern Minnesota tonight. A lot of fun and it was also announced on our local late night news here tonight that the northern lights may be visible from our location tonight. So I'm heading outside to see what I can see in the northern sky. 7-3 and thanks for watching. It was announced on the local news earlier that the northern lights would be I'm heading outside now because, I don't know,